Mike. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to our wrap-up project for Flush. Um, this is going to be that coral reef poster that you've been seeing on our uh, on our schedule, and uh, I'm going to introduce it to you right now. So, right now, you can see that I have um, uh, my screen shared with you, and I have uh, kind of the background of um, Google Classroom. And um, I haven't put it up, posted yet, because I didn't want anybody to get a head start on it before anybody else did before this video came out. So uh, what you're going to be doing is creating a coral reef poster uh, that is, as, I, as you can see here, colorful, informative, that Noah, Abby, and their father and family would be proud of to hang in the Florida Keys. I'm going to give you um, some links, and uh, you can see them here. Um, these are from some... Uh, University of Florida, so .edu, very trustworthy source. Um, conservation and threats to the keys, all right, some great articles here. And actually, um, a poster that has actually been made by, um, if you can you know, see right here, by some of the people that work in the Florida Keys. And I just thought, hey, you know what, they can do better than this. A kid I'm, I'm sure this was made by some adult and it, listen, it looks good. It gets the, it gets the message across, but I was like, you know what? I think we have some kids in our class that can definitely come up with something a little bit more uh, creative than that. So that's why that last one is be creative. All right. Be very creative. Um, this is your best talent. Go for it and, and create a, a one page, one page. And I'm going to, I'm, Probably now think about it, put that in there so we don't have, uh, because it's a poster. So uh, that's what's important to, to know about making a poster is that it needs to be easy to read and understand. When you see a poster up, especially one that gives a warning or a, you know, information, it's got to be quick, easy to read, and you got to be able to get your point across right away. All right, so you don't need really small text and lots and lots of it. We just need to have, because uh, most people, when they glance by a poster, they're walking past and they're making a quick glance and then they're moving on. So you got to get to them very quickly. Another one is, um, you know, like we talk about with Tar Wars, negative themes, yes, you're talking about destroying a, a coral reef, but try to stay that, stay that positive light. So try to stay positive because... Um, if it's negative, people just kind of, eh, whatever, no big deal. But when it's a negative thing, but spun in a way of like, hey, help us protect those defenseless, you know, little sea turtles that love to walk onto the beach and lay their eggs, or, right? Then you 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 you're kind of putting them in a situation where they feel like they they're obligated to to help. So, anyways, all this stuff will be posted. It is along with this video and uh, for you to use to help create your poster. But now on to Canva. So if you go over to Canva, um, you can you know make sure you're logged in. Um, you can see right here, um, eh, recently I made that brochure video. So there's that still there. Now this might pop up because it's a very common one people use Canva for. If not, poster. Um, and let's try to, and I'm, once again, I'm not gonna say it's required let's try to stay in um um kind of portrait mode not landscape so once you do once again you click it and you can take a look here and here are some you know obviously you can start with a blank one or some of these are already hmm, very similar to what i just showed you of the other um, of that um coral reef poster that you can just drag and drop some things in here so some of these might to uh, a great, uh, a good segue right into what to do during a natural disaster. Well, this could easily change into how to care for our coral reefs in the Florida Keys. So um, this is the best part about this is because you get a chance to be ultra creative here. All right. Well, once this video posts and I get all this stuff up here, have at it. Uh, I'm putting a due date for Monday. So uh, you'll have this these two days and the weekend. Obviously, once again, uh, because of our situation, a lot of our um, uh, scheduled uh, what am I due dates, geez, I'm, I'm struggling today, um, aren't necessarily 
set in stone. So make sure you, you know, you're getting uh, as much work as you can in and um, looking forward to seeing these. Oh, once again, when you are um, ready to share, I'm gonna move myself out of the way. Remember that um, there's a couple ways you can share uh, this with me. One is um, you actually click share, but you have to actually physically type in my email address. It's not going to populate or pop up like it does with Google. Okay, so you would click share, type in Hoobity. A lot of people make it lkgeorge.com, remember to .org. Another one is this, um, is when you want to, you just download PDF print, either one print or standard, doesn't matter, PDF print, standard, even if you click JPEG, you'd still be fine. But these are the two we want. And then you just attach it to an email to, to me. So two different ways to share. If you are um, unfamiliar with that, don't, once again, just send me an email. But the easiest ways are to share or download and attach to an email. All right, well, I'm gonna get this up and loaded and um, I look forward to seeing everybody at 9 a.m. this morning. All right, everyone, goodbye.